Hello everyone, Organ Crystals, we all need them, we all want them, and when we do need them, we don't have them. So, in today's video, updated 2023 guide by the gaming weasel, of course, being me, on how to form Organ Crystals extremely easily and without any possible issues. So, without any more dilly-dallying, let's get straight into the actual guide. First of all, a resource chance and the resource double booster is gonna be extremely beneficial. Now, keep in mind, Organ Crystals is a resource form in the void. Now it disappears after 24 hours, basically meaning when the Warframe daily rotation ends, for me it's gonna be 1 a.m. CET, then the organ crystal is gonna disappear. Not when you pick it up 24 hours, but depending on the time of the actual pickup, it is gonna be up until the daily rotation actually refreshes. So keep that in mind. Now you usually need organ crystals around two or three of them because you're crafting a primed weapon or mod or something like that or actually a prime warframe sorry and you really need that three so let's do this quickly and easily bring yourself a weapon such as the tenon envoy and the spore laser for example any sort of aoe weapon is going to be extremely good if you do have if you of course don't it's going to be a little bit harder but still we're going to try to pull it out uh, use uh, the prime fulmination and the prime to firestorm mod for secondaries and also of course primary weapons as well now for the warframe of choice you can choose something different you can choose wukong you can choose different Warframes, but I have chosen a fully dedicated forming Zaku. Now, Zaku's fourth ability, the Vast on Time, breaks crates. So we're focusing on, well, as you can see by the build, on range, a little bit of duration, a lot of efficiency, and a little bit of power strength, just so it is a little bit more useful. Now, instead of our third ability, we have Mag's Pull. Pull is amazing because with the Augment Mon Greedy Pull, you pull loot towards yourself. Now, keep in mind that this does not work through walls. It used to, I think a long time ago, but now it doesn't. So you're gonna be after in the line of sight of the resource to actually pick them up. But basically, how's this gonna go? Honestly, you're gonna go into one of two nodes, Hebit or Yuko Capture in the Void, and basically get the capture target and travel around the map, basically breaking crates with your fourth ability or even with your AoE weapon, and basically pulling the resources closer to you. If you miss them, well, try not to do that. And if, of course, you can, try to farm the Organ Crystal nodes. They look like this and they can be found in the map. And killing enemies, you do have a really, and I do mean a really low chance of getting Organ Crystals. So, in my honest opinion, playing longer missions is not beneficial at all. So, Basically, Zaku with the Crate Breaker build that I showed you earlier, two AoE weapons or even one could be pretty good, and also boosters if you have them, Smita Kavat if you have them, Yuko or Hepit, and there you go. That is basically how you form yourself up the organ crystals that you need, and basically you're gonna be making everything that you possibly want to in that one, two, three days, or whenever you possibly need it. This has been you, me. The lovely host, the gaming weasel. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, do leave a like, a comment, and do subscribe for more. And I will see you guys on the next one. The gaming weasel over and out.